Good afternoon, everybody, and happy post-Memorial Weekend uh, for those of you that got to get out and celebrate. Um, we've got a new week here. We've got a new lineup here at the San Dimas Wine Shop and Tasting Room. My name is Dylan, and we've got an amazing lineup. Uh, the week is called The Heat Is On, so somebody call a fireman because this is a really, really good lineup. Let's take it right up from the top, Eric. Um, this is the Domaine, uh, this is Domaine de la Garnier, and what this is is um, it's a Muscadet, so the Muscadet is on the Loire Valley, which is on the west coast, almost, it's right at the ocean. And the grape is called Melon de Bourgnon, is the, is the name of the grape. All done surly, it sees no oak. Uh, the classic pairing for those who like this is oysters on the half shell. Uh, anytime you go wine tasting in this region, that's what you get is the, is the pairing for that. Then we go over to Lodi, we have the uh, McKay, that's the, it's a Grenache, it's a Grenache Rosé. All done, of course, stainless steel, big, fruity, punchy, the way Grenache should be, and it comes from Lodi, so it's just got that extra, real sun-drenched, uh, fruit-driven wine. But really, really good for backyard barbecues. Then we go to one of my favorites. This is the Lafort. This is made by, uh, by Joseph Druin. Uh, this is a Pinot Noir. It's just a classic red burgundy, and I love the way these wines are made. They're, you know, comparatively speaking, they're a lot thinner, and... Um, but a lot more tart than our Pinot Noirs that we get here in California, but it makes it just a real perfect food wine. Then we go over to the Domaine Par. This is the Caboche. This is a Syrah Grenache. This is their Cote de Rhone. Love this. It does see a little bit of oak on the Syrah side. The Grenache sees no, no oak. It's all stainless steel. Um, beautiful, punchy, bright cherries. Um, anything you would expect, everything you would expect from that. Also has that spice of licorice that you would also expect from, uh, from the Rhone Valley. Then we go over here to the Dutton Goldfield, and this here, uh, this is the Spectrum. And this is a blend of Syrah, Pinot Noir, and Zinfandel. I know it sounds like an odd blend, but it works. All, of course, it's all oaked and super delicious, big bright cherries. Then we finish up with the Firestone. This is, uh, comes out of San Inez, and that's their Cabernet Sauvignon. They do put a little bit of Petit Verdot in it. Um, just a beautiful lineup. Uh, all of you that probably got to grill this weekend, hopefully you got to see some of these wines. If not, the grilling season is just starting, so make sure you come pick these up. Everybody cheers to you. And don't forget to join us for our winemaker series. We continue with Brudicao, who are the makers of Bliss and all the Brudicao wines that we've made here. Jeff Miller will be here on June 6th, which is a week from today. Please don't miss out. That is going to be a great wine tasting event. Uh, he'll be pouring six wines, so we'll be, we'll be getting to taste all of it. Um, and then, uh, just continue to stay tuned. Um, we don't have the schedule for the, for the lineups for the rest of the week. I mean, I'm sorry, for the rest of the month, as far as the tastings that go, but I'm sure Melissa's going to put something really delicious together, and it'll be fun. Cheers.